Hey everybody, Eric Bear here, and uh, we're about to do another unboxing, which is super exciting. Total upgrade to my gear, and I have with me Babak Beheshi from Standard Deviation. I don't know if you guys know, but Standard Deviation has been around for 20 years, making uh, some of the most advanced hardware for uh, for for the industry in you know in the biggest productions. Um, you want to tell us a little bit, uh, Babak, before we dive into the gear, just give a little background on yourself and, and, uh, yeah. thanks Eric. Thanks for having me here. Uh, really appreciate it. It's, it's exciting, uh, <laughs> to watch you play with this toy. Uh, we always build them, but, uh, seldom do we get, uh, to watch someone, uh, open it up and play with it for the first time. Um, uh, I, been building mocap hardware for 25 years and um, standard deviation has been around for 20. Uh, we designed electronics. We designed our own mocap cameras uh, from the sensor up. We designed um, HMCs. We have a whole line of them. And uh, usually we deal with the big studios. Um, but this uh, iPhone HMC is a departure for us. Uh, it's very nice to put a little high-end gear into the hands of the enthusiasts and, uh, and then people who would enjoy it. It's very exciting. Even though I'm a classically trained actor, I spent the, the majority of my life as an entrepreneur, you know, running tech companies. And it was just recently that I retired from that so that I could focus full-time on acting. And, uh, you know, been building this home studio under the, uh, you know, the whole COVID-19 situation so that I can do remote performance and uh, avail myself as, as, a, as, a, as a body and as an actor and as a voice to, um, to productions wherever they are. And, uh, and in this process, I've done some of my own, you know, hardware hacking. I, uh, I don't know if you can see this, you know, I got a, a tactical... Uh, helmet and built this whole kind of cage system that you know I can adjust and move and then had to put uh, a counterweight this is like a you know an ankle weight uh, so it's it's very well balanced um, uh, uh, which is great if you had a head of steel nice it's a good job so well thanks you know I like it it's kind of fun. And, you know, it's going to go into the museum because this thing is killing me. What's just arrived are two packages. All right. We've got the box that came from Standard Deviation and uh, an iPhone 12 mini just arrived because we're going to maximize the minimization of all this weight on my head um, for freedom and more fun. OK, so let's start by unboxing the helmet. Let me know if you need help setting it up. Yeah, here we are. It's so great to have you in person. Like the guy who runs the company, it's the best. Oh my gosh, it's so light. It's, are you sure there's something in here? It's like one running shoe. That's how light this thing feels. So there is a pack of extra foam in there. Okay. And there's a small plastic bag of uh, miscellaneous screws and things you may lose. Do Great. not lose the bag if you lose. Don't lose the bag. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. These are things uh, it often happens, uh, especially during production, the little screw drops and you scramble looking for it. I know exactly how that goes. It's incredibly light. I mean, it just seems unbelievable that this would actually do it. about the same as your iPhone 12 Pro, the whole helmet. It just feels like nothing. Yeah, it's about 240 grams. Okay. And the way we kept the weight off was um, using some aluminum alloys that uh, are stronger, uh, but uh, yeah. we could shave a little bit off. 
Right. And wait. So, so what do you think? Do I do I need to do something first, or can I just try and put it on? I could try it. Uh, yeah, lock the, give it a try. What do you know? Can I see you in profile? <laughs> what do you know? <laughs> I didn't know, guys, I didn't send him any measurements or anything. I'm just like a out-of-the-box kind of guy. So the first thing you want to do is give yourself a browse up and touch your forehead. See what the lowest point is that... that yeah, it's right there. Helmet yeah. And we'll, yeah, exactly. Okay. Okay, right. that looks good. So you, the next thing is you want to make sure your ears are centered uh, in the earpieces and yours are. So it's the right I feel about, size. yeah. And the last thing is pull the uh, ratchet in the back down, pull it down, but lock it, it with the two screws on the sides. There you go. Now, oh my gosh, dude, this is incredible. Yeah, and I did the ratchet. Okay. Okay, so it's memory yeah. foam. This yeah. foam will settle on you. And yeah. in about 30 seconds, one minute, uh, you'll reach the comfort zone. You can take the ratchet one more click. Okay. It's like, you know, boiling a frog, right? Mm -mm. You just keep turning up the heat. Yeah, I don't like taking tools near the face. Yeah. So everything is settable by hand. Man. I feel so pro now. Okay, so this is the iPhone 10. And, uh, oh, you know what we need to do is we need to attach my head sensor onto this somewhere. So, it's unbelievable. Oh, it can go on the ratchet um, surface. Yeah, what do you do? So, let's see. That was super easy. That was unexpectedly easy. Now, let's do this guy and take additional weight off of it. The phone that I bought is an iPhone 12 Pro Max. Figured we're spending all our time, you know, at home. And uh, why not have a big phone? You know, I'm getting old. It's hard to see. Why well, not makes it might make my life easier for me? So, uh, so I got the big phone. And now we got the super small phone to make this. Uh, situation work. So let's do a little size comparison of these guys. So do you, do you happen to know the actual weight differences between these guys? Yeah, your max is the heaviest. Uh, okay. About a half a pound. It's over eight ounces. <laughs> That's so crazy. So which is good for a hamburger, but not necessarily good for a phone. Uh-huh. Right. Um, the mini is a little bit more than half of that. It's four point seven yeah. ounces. And the comparison between the um, the mini and the iPhone ten, the original iPhone ten. Uh, you're about a third less. The iPhone ten is about six point uh, fourteen ounces. Yeah. And uh, the mini is uh, four point. Uh, Oh, four and three quarters. That's it's great. Or 135 grams if you have a metric brain. It, you know, it just feels it's it's a really it's so sweet. It's so small. Is it crazy just to buy an iPhone just for my headset? 
but um well yeah. you know if you're used to <laughs> paying software subscriptions it's yeah. not a bad deal you know the software is free for this and uh It's true. It's just happened. It's a camera that just happens to have a whole computer on it. We're going to go get live link face. I still can't believe how light this is. It's so amazing. Install it. Okay. Um, there we are. The phone is smaller than your gummy pad that it goes on. Oh, no. <laughs> See it? I hadn't counted on this. Okay. <laughs> awesome. That's so great. Okay. Well, there we are in uh, Unreal Engine using the new standard deviation lightweight helmet for the iPhone with the brand new iPhone 12 mini. So we shaved off a bunch of weight from my homemade helmet. We've shaved off a bunch of weight from the iPhone 12. We've amped up our performance with the, uh, with the iPhone 12 processor and uh, up and running in no time. So there you have it. And uh, well, thanks to Standard Deviation. Thanks to Babak and the great team of engineers bringing their technology from, you know, the, the pro level stuff down to our home cap studios. I feel like I've got a, a golden crown of awesomeness on my head now. And uh, I'm just gonna wanna wear it every day, get into my studio, do some recording. And uh, you know, I, I highly recommend it. I'm, I, I'm, I'm very comfortable, very happy with this on my head and my shoulders are happy. Um, so uh, you're the best, so excited. And um, anything else I need to know? Uh, no, uh, give the, try the thicker foam so okay. you get a feel for both. Okay. Uh, see what works best for you. Awesome. Well, thank you so much. This was awesome. Wonderful. Thank you, Eric. This was, uh, this was fabulous. There it is. Another unboxing end-to-end -end experience for you. So uh, go out, have fun. I'm Eric Bear. Be safe in the volume.